Here we are. The, they already took one store front up. They already fucking, and it's not even open. It's just there. They're just occupying space like the fucking land barons they are. Pieces of fucking shit. They take our fucking waterfront away. You know what? They won't even fucking have an interview with me. I'm a real journalist. I like to get both sides of the story. Well, they wouldn't even fucking interview me. These fucking pieces of shit. I'm just doing some redocumentation on trying to. This is about seven months later after we talked to these people. These people had no problem. They had no problem interviewing me. They had no problem interviewing me. Right? You know what? The George wouldn't interview me. To me, that's kind of like pleading the fifth because you're fucking guilty. I gotta go on and talk to these people. Hello, just coming to say hi. We're still doing the doc. That's the lady that we did an interview with. Fantastic interview. This is their place. The fight goes on. Take care. Here's the tripod right here. This is a brother. This is the brother. How you doing, brother? This is the three-legged dog. His name's Chico. His parents are kind of dickheads, but this lady is one of the sweetest ladies in the round. Taking care of the little boy that uh, could. Chico's a survivor. <laughs> and so is this lady. This lady is a caretaker. Chico's a survivor. Thank God for both of them. Take care. Have a good one. There's the tripod. It's getting locked. Look at this right now. <sighs> Paper. This lady delivers papers and looks after dogs that the owners can't look after. There's a tripod standing there waiting for her. Great dog. Great dog. Great dog. Chico the man with the tripod. Yep, see this? This is what she does every day because her parents can't. Hey, Cheeks. How's it going, kid? How you doing, brother? How's it going, brother? Want a paper? Pardon me? We have fresh paper. Sure. Take a local. Right on. Thank you. The first one to have a Local paper. Blah, blah, blah. Chico's cool. Hey, Chico. He follows me away in the house. He's I know he will. I know he. He's got abandonment issues like all dogs. medicine spots. I uh, come and meditate here. Especially if I'm having a rough day. I'm having a rough day today. But uh, it's a nice place to meditate. Good place. And of course I got a guru with me. Of course I do. I always got a guru with me. Here it is. Got another one there too. So after I finish them, I'll be in a lot better fucking shape if I can do some talking. Because right now I'm fucking feeling sick as a fucking dog. But I wanted to show you this place. This is a very beautiful thing you got there. The red maples. You got the little pond. We already did a talk about this nice little pond. Uh, 
Copy Kirk, who's already down here with me, but I just, I just like, I like to get a couple of shots in on this one. There's a beautiful mural right here. I did an amazing mural. Fantastic artist in this. Uh, there's an orca whale. I gotta get this way. I get this fucking orca because it's fucking cool. There's some salmon. Fish. Native art. There, there's a little salmon there. They should have been. Yeah. Yeah. Orcas have become. Or not orcas, just killer whales. Kind of a topic lately. I think I'm gonna go swimming with one uh, pretty soon. I don't know. I'm kind of looking forward to trying to do it anyway. I ain't no fucking expert, but I'm gonna try. Okay. So we just got a bag. You know, there's 17 miles, there's 17 square kilometers of the Pacific Ocean that's covered with fucking bags, right? So we just found one. And, uh, look at that. I don't, I can't read that shit. What is it? Fucking Asian? Yeah. I don't Pissant. Pissant. Pissants. Yeah, that's what it is. It's pissant fucking bags. Right? 17 square kilometers of it in the Pacific Ocean. Way to go, guys. Yeah, this is, uh, just cool looking, I don't know. Fucking looks pretty cool. I'm gonna take a fucking picture of it or not even a picture. I'm gonna take a little bit of a video. the camera's uncharged it's not taking a good resolution so we'll come back and do it fucking later okay here we're somewhere in the middle of july he's uh he's got it uh, almost ready for detail it's, uh mr freisen's uh yeah it's pretty cool so this hasn't been detailed yet but it's been shaped out and uh I think you can all get a picture of what it's going to look like when it's done. Hopefully we'll get one. But uh, yeah, pretty impressive. It stands about five feet five, maybe five and a half feet. It's uh, pretty cool. Anyways, he's not done it yet when he does the detailing. That, uh, that's when the magic comes, but it's a lot of hard work that's been put into this already. And, uh, signing up. Okay, it's uh, the same day, just two minutes after I just shot the uh, bear. Now um, he's doing an eagle in here, or a raven. It's a raven, but it's a big piece, and I didn't know he was doing it, so we're going to go. There's Mr. Proizen right there. There's Greg. And uh, here we go. Look at this. Uh, this is the raven. Just started it yesterday. Going to sand it today. Going to be done in a couple of days. But this piece is about five feet long, six feet long. This is a six foot long piece here of a raven. Anyways, well, hopefully we'll get a picture of it in a couple of days when it's done. Signing out.
side of it. And Walter Cronkite, play a note. <laughs>